So today I'm gonna to go through my four favorite tips for making a synthetic hair topper look more realistic. I'm going to comb away the fibers for the area where I want the part to be. So I'm gonna really separate all of these fibers all the way down to the lace and um, the monofilament. And I'm going to pluck a few fibers along that lace line so I expose more of the monofilament. Um, and I'm going to do this in a little bit of an uneven pattern. I don't want like a totally straight part. And you'll see, I am really taking out very, very few few fibers in this process. I just want to widen that part line just a little bit. Uh, so pluck as little or as much as you like for your taste. Next, I want to train these fibers to stay in this part position. So I'm going to spray it with some water from a spray bottle um, just so that I can give it a little bit more weight and hold it in place. This Uniwigs Hope hair topper is not heat friendly. So I got it wet because I want to create steam instead of using a dry heat on these fibers, which will ruin them. And then I'm going to use a blow dryer on the low setting because I do not want to damage these fibers. I just want to heat them up a little bit to help reform them in this new position that I've placed it in. Next, I want to really set off that part and I'm going to do that with this concealer and I am going to go right along that uh, monofilament or lace that I exposed when I was doing the plucking. If you end up getting the concealer on the fibers, you can try to blot it away or you can use a Q-tip dipped in makeup remover to remove it. Here is a close up of this part after I am done working with it and I will clean it up with a little bit of makeup remover before I'm done. I am using a steamer and the steam is a safe way to heat up these fibers. The last thing that we're gonna do is um, if you feel like your fibers are a little bit too shiny for your own natural hair, you can dull that shine with a little bit of dry shampoo. And a word of caution with brunettes and dry shampoo. I'll take this piece here. Here is the level of shine without the dry shampoo. And this is the level of shine with the dry shampoo. And so it will flake off, but for the most part, it will do a good job of making these synthetic fibers look like real natural human hair.